I love my kids, man. I tell you, my, my youngest is 6'6 six, six now. He's a very, very tall uh, string bean of a kid. And I can't believe it. I remember when they were just babies. I'm tell you there's nothing like having a kid. I don't think there's anything in the world better than having a baby. And I just lied to each and every one of you. <laughs> oh, there's something better than having a baby. We all know what that is. <laughs> you betcha, right? It's having a wife that's not pregnant anymore. What the heck is that about? Why don't they warn us? They should tell us, hey, if this sticks, I'm gonna be crazy six or seven months, okay? No, you gotta find out on your own. You come home, hi, honey. <laughs> What's the matter? What's wrong? <laughs> <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> I'm just happy to see you. Lucky me. <laughs> I thought it was gonna get better after we had the baby got worse. Postpartum depression, that's what they call it. They should call it run for your life now. I come home, hi honey, you tried breastfeeding. <laughs> There's nothing you can say to that at all. You just stand there, hide all the pointy stuff, sleep with one eye open. You know? It's not fair. It's not fair because I have tried breastfeeding. Not on purpose. I learned a valuable lesson, though, never hold your newborn with your shirt off. I found that out. They don't know any better at that age, and they're holding your kid. Hey, Bob. Whoa, 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 whoa. No! You think the hair would deter the little sucker, you know? He's looking at me like I'm empty. I always thought it was a warm, loving moment between woman and child. No, it's like having a, a, a barracuda attached to your nipple, you know? I thought he bit my nipple off. Which sounds like a Russian skater, doesn't it? Andre beat my nipple off.